Tashkent hosts regional conference EU Central Asian Young Leaders Shifting the Paradigm for Sustainable Water Action. The event aims to be the opportunity for youth in regional cooperation and focus on sustainable water action. Details on the event in the next report. The conference gathered 100 participants from the five Central Asian countries under the age of 35. Participants, including students, represent youth-led initiatives, civil society organizations, researchers, media, young politicians, as well as the government experts. Water is a very limited resource, especially in, in Central Asia. And so that means that each one of us, every inhabitant, is not only down to the, the governments that have to they of course have to provide the framework, but each inhabitant in Central Asia has to take care that that water that he or she uses is used in the best possible way, the most efficient manner, so that nothing is lost. And there, thereby, in fact, probably the um, water that is there can be enough for everybody, but it means really managing things well. During the conference, it was mentioned that water scarcity could significantly affect the GDP of the region. Supporting the implementation of the European Union Central Asia Roadmap on the important topics of water management and people-to-people -people contact was on the spotlight of discussions. In today's conference, we are engaging with experts on various questions related to water conversation. The ongoing two-day workshop with Nordic University focuses on enhancing the sustainability efforts of the United Nations, particularly in six priority areas targeted for the improvement by 2030. One of these areas is ensuring universal access to water and sanitation. A major challenge in Central Asia is the water supply, as the melting of mountain glaciers could result in significant reductions in GDP. GDP by 2030 or 2040. This underscores the urgent need for effective water management strategies in the region. Supporting the implementation of the European Union Central Asia Roadmap on the important topics of water management and people-to-people -people contacts were on the spotlight of discussions. We have to keep our uh, water resources for future generation uh, to keep it uh, right. Uh, now today's conference is taught us uh, how to save our water for future, future generation, how to use uh, smartly and keep it safe uh, because uh, we cannot imagine our life uh, without water. Tedhi Hakala, the special EU representative from Central Asia, commented on the water challenge in the region. The challenges, of course, are huge. I, I have to be very honest with that, and this is how, why we are also concentrating on water sector and water management. First of all, uh, if we start from the fact that Central Asia uh, suffers a lot of clim climate change, I mean, it hits, hits Central Asia very hard. You may watch the whole interview with the special representative in our review program this Sunday at 6 p.m. on Uzreport TV.